something exciting just arrived. Oh, oh it's really heavy. Hi there, welcome to today's vlog. I've got a couple of exciting packages to open for you. As you saw in the intro, we've got a big one right here and another box right here as well. Happy and Polly sent over some goodies that I am so excited for. Happy and Polly sell amazing and cute cat supplies, cat toys, cat beds, all the good stuff online and they were so kind enough to send over a bunch of goodies for Luna and Marnie, my two kitties. So while I'm unboxing everything from Happy and Polly, I wanted to let you know that they are actually sponsoring today's video. So huge thank you to Happy and Polly. I'm so excited to work with a company that loves cats as much as I do and they provide so many amazing supplies, toys, beds, items for your kitties. Highly recommend checking out their website. Everything shipped super, super quick and the quality is amazing. Comment down below if you own cats or a dog or any types of pets and what their names are. I would love to know. I love my two kitties so much. I would do anything to give them the world. So being able to spoil them right now with items from Happy and Polly is just the best thing in the whole entire world. I also have an awesome discount code for you for 10% off the entire website Happy and Polly. So all of the info for that will also be down below. I'm so excited because Happy and Polly sent over eight little ball toys for them, natural wool balls. I have a feeling that it also came, haha, the good stuff, with catnip. The cats are already so interested in what I'm unboxing, which is so cute. Oh, I bet this is full of catnip because Luna wants the mushroom so bad. Oh, this is so exciting. They also sent me this huge catnip filled pink mushroom for the cats. How cute is this? I really love mushrooms. You've got to see this. <laughs> oh, do you guys like the new toys? Yeah, that mushroom must be stuffed with catnip. What a treat. Get it, girl. Oh, <laughs> my cats are so happy and there's still so much more to unpack. Oh my God, this is gonna be their new favorite toy. Luna says, thank you, Happy and Polly. I love it. Hey, Marnie, do you wanna try these balls? Look, we've got some balls too. Look, girls. Oh, what's that? Oh my God, they are so cute when they play. So the cats are going to play with their new toys while I continue unboxing. Of course, every single product that I show you will be linked down below. I'm also going to link their website. Don't forget to use my code as well when you're shopping for your cats to get a discount for 10% off. Anyway. Oh my God, this is so cute. I have always wanted one of these for my cats. I got them one of those little bed tent sleeper things. I'll set it up and show you in a second. I opened this a few days ago because I didn't realize it was part of the Happy and Polly products at first, but they also sent over this water fountain for the kitties. 
It's electric, so I do have to plug it in, but it keeps the water running. And I, ha I chose this really cute mushroom style in like a very light, subtle green hue because my kitchen has more of the, this color theme going on. But I'm really excited to set this up as well for the cats. I've been meaning to get them like a larger water bowl because I am always worried about their water supply. If I leave for like six hours out of the day, I want to make sure they have fresh running water available to them. Lastly, the big item that Happy and Polly sent over whew, is something that I have been meaning to get the cats ever since we moved into this new house. I'm going to put it right there. Let me know if you have any guesses because these kitties loved their old one in the apartment. They are going to freak out when I set this up. The last thing that Happy and Polly sent over that I am so grateful for is a cat tree, which I have to put together, but I am so excited to finally have a big cat tree in my living room so that the kitties have like a dedicated place for them that they know is theirs. Oh, this is so cute. Definitely gonna require a lot of assembly. It's nothing I can't handle. So many fun scratchers. Oh my goodness. The girls are gonna freak out. Oh, look at all these fun colors. Oh my God, look at Marnie. Marnie, do you love it? Oh my gosh, Happy and Polly, thank you so much already. My cats are the happiest little things in the whole world. This is gonna be such a fun vlog. I love watching vlogs of people's pets, like anything for more cat content. Ooh, get it, girl. They're so cute. She loves that mushroom. Whoa, here comes Luna. She's gonna get her. Luna's got the blue ball. <laughs> oh, they are so cute. Can you believe a huge cat tree fit in this box? I have to take all of the empty boxes into my garage to the recycling, and then let's build a cat tree. She's kneading. Oh my gosh, I haven't even put this like up somewhere yet, but she already loves it. That's good to know. started using it. Look at all your goodies. Oh, and we're sunbathing with all of our new toys. What do you think? Do we trust it? Are we going to take a sip of water? I think that's a new water bowl. Please drink from it. I just finished setting up all of the new Happy and Polly products around the house. We have this beautiful finished cat tree that Marnie and Luna both already love. The second that I put it together, they were both all over it. Oh, I'm so glad they love it. It's the cutest 
colors super easy to put together the cats love it i've been letting them just play with these balls all around the living room but i don't know where to keep them yet or what to do with them they've been having a blast i feel like i should take these out but the cats also like to like take it out themselves i still need to figure out where to put this cat bed it's the cutest thing i love the little leaves and it did come with this little pillow inside. As you saw, Marnie already took a nap in here, so she loves it. It's super cozy, it makes them feel safe. So I don't know where to put it yet. I was thinking in the sunroom or somewhere in the living room, even my bedroom would be a good spot. And they both have been loving this catnip filled mushroom toy as you've been seeing. It's so freaking cute. I feel like I have children right now because my living room is just covered in toys. And then the last thing that I set up as well is their new water fountain. I think they're both a little intimidated by it and I want to get some sort of like cord hider to hide the cord right here so you can't see it as obviously but this was also super easy to put together it has so much water in here so i know they're going to be good on water supply as long as they both drink from it that's kind of my concern right now is that they won't touch it but i'm sure they will once they get used to it i love the mushrooms it's so cute i also did let it run for about five minutes just to flush out the filter and then i changed the water but what's really awesome about this this filter is that it comes with a lot of extras so you don't have to order more all the time so there's a filter in there right now but it, it comes with an extra carbon filter and then three of these like pump filters and there's already one of these carbon filters in there and one of these so these are extras and i'm going to change it out when need be this is so exciting they have the cute little mushroom water filter again huge thank you to happy and polly for sponsoring this video and sending over so many cute adorable cat products that luna marnie and i all love so much i'm so excited to show you in future vlogs like the cats in their new cat tree or in the cat bed and what they think of their water fountain so definitely subscribe and stay tuned for for that and again don't forget to use my discount code down below at their website and go get your cats some toys beds treats like everything is on the site they're gonna love it i literally feel like i have children because my living room floor is covered in cat toys but they are so loved so spoiled and look at that beautiful cat tree it's so cute this cat tree is called the wonderland cat tree i believe they have a ton of different designs and sizes and colors so definitely check out their site to see which one you vibe with the most i just thought this one was super fitting and i like the pastel light colors super super cute oh my gosh okay so she's putting her paw in the water and then drinking the water off of her paw but it's a step good girl marnie you're being so brave. Oh my God, that is so cute. <laughs> Yum. going to the Minnesota State Fair so I'm really excited about that but I'm just trying to clean the house he's actually allergic to cats so that is the reason why I'm cleaning the house so vigorously before he comes over not because it's like a sexist thing I just want to make sure there's no cat hair I want to vacuum Swiffer I usually wash the bedding because the cats go on the bed all of that but also I'm doing laundry right now hopefully you can't hear it too much in this clip but pretty much my whole closet was dirty, so I had to do laundry. Speaking of, I got a few clothing items from a company. So many cozy fall sets. This clothing company called Lead In was really sweet and sent me some pieces to try out. So they sent over five pieces of clothing. I have this two piece green set that says hang out with you right here. And then a little brown, kind of like zip up crew neck top. 
a beautiful sundress, and then these really fun checkered casual pants to wear. Everything was packaged really well. They had tissue paper between all of the clothing items. Again, huge thank you to Let In for these pieces. I do have a discount code for you, so that will be on the screen as well as down below. I'll be sure to link all these pieces. This video isn't sponsored. These are just gifts, but I'm really grateful. So hopefully everything fits, but let's try them on now and see how it goes. Okay, first I'm trying on the green set. It is so cozy. I got a size small for reference. Super, super cozy. It's a little big, which is nice because it is cropped. And then the drawstrings are super nice. Also, I realized, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a pocket. I love pockets. So, oh my God, and there's a front pocket. This is the best. I can't wait to have cozy fall days wearing this around the house while I get work done. It's a super, super cute set. I love it. This is the sundress. It's so cute. I feel so girly in this. It fits really well. There's a zipper on the side. The fabric is really thick too, so as you can tell, it's not see-through. Definitely a few warm days left this summer to be able to wear this, but this fits super well. I really like it. Next, we have those fun checkered, kind of like jogger sweatpants. There are pockets on both sides, which are super nice. These are super, super soft. I love the pockets. It fits really well. I am definitely gonna wear these a ton in the fall. And lastly, we have this beige ribbed zip up um, long sleeve sweater top. I love this so much. I have it with my shorts right now because this is a really good like warm fall look, but this also came with those checkered pants as well. It's so warm and cozy, but I love how fitted it feels at the same time. I also love any type of zipper on top with this ring zipper so you can get a little saucy with it or you can zip it up as high as you'd like. Brown is definitely the color this year so this is such a cozy vibe and I still feel put together because of the collar that this has. Super super cute. Like I said all the clothing items are linked down below. Don't forget to use my discount code and again thank you to Let In if that's how you pronounce it. My apologies if I'm wrong but thank you to the clothing company for sending over such cute pieces for the fall. I'm sure that you're going to see a lot of them in my future vlogs as I wear them. So now you know where I got them from, but I'll always link them down below if they're in a video. But yeah, it's so cozy. <laughs> I really messed up. I wasn't gonna film this. I wasn't even going to film me taking like my lunch break and eating because I don't like including that in vlogs, but I know I just shot like a cute little clip of me cooking my lunch, which is basically just leftovers. I've got an ear of corn on the cob left and then green beans and I wanna use up the rest of my portobello mushrooms, but I totally just ruined the beans because um, I'll just show you, but I was adding in the seasoning and I took off the whole cap of this garlic powder instead of just doing that, but I didn't realize that it didn't have the little thing on. So then I'll show you with this, with the cover. I went to do this on top of the beans, but the whole cover was off, like the whole cap. So I don't even know if these are edible now because it is covered in garlic powder. Like I tried to move it around, but it is caked on there. Oh my God, I'm so ashamed. I cannot believe I did that. These would have been so good too. I had garlic, all the seasoning, and just like a shiitake ton of um, garlic powder. So now I'm screwed. For some reason, I felt the need to share that with you because I have nobody else to tell that to right now and I thought it was kind of funny. So yeah, on a bright note, the flowers that I got from Trader Joe's the other day are blooming. Like, look at the roses. So I'm happy that they're blossoming. Okay, I'm gonna try to eat these green beans. Poor Ashton, I'm gonna smell like garlic for the rest of the day. Tonight, get me to eat first. Okay, so- Marnie. Do you like it?
I just read the sweetest letter from Nicole, who's been a long-term subscriber of mine. And as soon as I saw this come in the mail, it's kind of loud out here. Let's go inside. It's only September 3rd, and as soon as the sun sets, it gets chilly outside. Oh, hi Luna. I just read a letter that a really, really sweet subscriber named Nicole wrote to me. And it's funny because in like the first sentence, she introduces herself and says like she wasn't sure if I would recognize her name. But as soon as I saw this letter arrive and I saw her name in the back, I got so excited because I knew right away that it was from you. I am going to talk directly to one person now in this video for the next 30 seconds. So apologies to everyone who's not Nicole, but thank you so, so much for taking the time to write this really sweet letter to not only me but she addressed it to Luna and Marnie as well and I had no idea that she has been following my channel since my freshman year in Ohio at college like that feels like a completely different life to me that was what seven years ago not to mention that was also when I started this channel so she really has been here through it all and the other week I was even wondering like huh I wonder who is the longest long-term subscriber like who was there in the beginning that is still actively keeping up with me and it just makes me that much more grateful for sharing my life online with you because nobody can understand or see like what i've gone through except for people like nicole and people that have watched my content and hearing about everything that you shared like i relate to so much more than i can say online and it's just really sweet to have such a tangible like thank you like this for my content because YouTube I love it so much but it can feel very isolating because I just have my laptop screen like I don't have that connection with people like this so getting a handwritten letter like this is just the sweetest thing in the whole wide world I'm so glad that my college content helped you so much and I felt the exact same way where my college experience didn't feel like anything that I saw online and that's a big reason why I wanted to make college content and share my story through college because I didn't have a good time. I struggled a lot and college just wasn't what everyone kind of, I felt like my college experience, I didn't feel the same way about it that my peers did. So it's really comforting in a way that you also thought that, not because I want you to feel that way, but because it's it makes you feel normal like oh it wasn't just me also i don't know how to say this it's gonna be very no one's gonna know what i'm talking about except for nicole but she mentions how she is like thinking about what is going to happen next in our lives and then she hints that she thinks something very exciting is gonna happen to her next year fingers crossed girl fingers crossed for me too i have a feeling I don't know, we'll see. This could age poorly. I could be jinxing it, but I, well, maybe not that soon, but you know, there's something there. So <laughs> yeah, I cannot wait to write back. That's the other thing. I do always try to reply to PO Box letters and cards like this. So if you want to send me something, my PO address is listed down below in every single video. You don't have to, this isn't me like asking you guys to, but the address is down below and it's right here on the screen. So if you feel inclined to send me something, know that my business slash PO address is always in the description box. Luna's the cutest in the world, but Ashton is going to be over in a little bit. We're going out to dinner tonight and then the Minnesota State Fair tomorrow. I think I'm going to end the vlog here just because the sun is setting and Ashton will be here soon. Huge thank you to Happy and Polly once again for sponsoring today's video and for sending my cats the best toys today and cat bed, water fountain, cat tree, all of the above. They are so grateful. I'm so grateful and I know they love their new climbing tree so, so so much and don't forget to check out happy and polly's website down below and use my discount code so you can get your cats some fun toys and climbing trees and whatever their hearts desire really happy and polly definitely have it on their site i think i'm going to sit next to luna and edit this vlog until ashton gets here but i'll see you in my next video very soon have a wonderful rest of your evening look who just got here in time to say goodbye marnie oh it's gonna be a cat party here in the sunroom, isn't it? Are we gonna have a cat party? Come here. Come say thank you to Happy and Polly. Luna would never let me pick her up like this for a video, but I know Marnie won't mind. So, Marnie says a huge thank you to Happy and Polly 
for her new toys and her new climbing tree and her new bed that she's already been in today. Luna, Marnie, and I will see you in my next video very soon. Oh, bye guys. Hey.